you need to write a speech. What's the very first thing you normally do when you need to write a speech for somebody else? Well, the presidential situation is a little bit different, but I, but what I, uh, the way I like to approach it is I, first of all, I like to know when, when they have to give the speech. For me, that's the most important thing to start out with. Okay, you know, when are you speaking? Who are you speaking to? Who is in the audience? What do they care about? What are they concerned about? What are they interested in? And, and you're really trying to come up with uh, that, that base of, of who the audience is. And then of course the speaker has their ideas uh, and credibility. You know, what are they, uh, what can they speak about credibly? What are they interested in communication? What is the one idea? I often ask this, if, if you have, if people leave this talk, in, what is the one idea that you want them to remember? And that's often a difficult question for people to answer because they, they might not have taken the time to think about that, or they might not have priority, prioritized, or they, they might resist boiling it down that much. Uh, but that's important to know what, 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 what's the takeaway. And, and then that can take a lot of different forms. It could be motivation to take action. It could be um, inspiration. It, it could be to inform. It could be to change their mind. It, but, but really thinking through what do we want to accomplish can, can shape uh, what, like I've done big arena speeches, you know, big political arena speeches, and they're really fun because you, you have a crowd to, to, to work with and, and, and that's going to give you some options uh, in terms of audience engagement that is very different than uh, a talk to 20 people uh, or at a, at a long table. And so trying to get a hold of your audience, get a hold of what you want to say and what you have credibility to say, what's the argument you wanna make. And then also um, what, what's the context uh, of the, not just the speech itself, but, but what moment are we in? Because I think that a lot of people lose sight of the fact that their audience is going to be listening to the news, they're going to be watching shows, they're going to be listening to podcasts. And there's a lot of, lot of uh, information competing for their attention. And, and how does your talk or presentation fit into that context uh, with integrity? Mm -hmm.